Hello and welcome to World of Floorcraft. We are Nelson and Karen Rose, and this is an interview on the giant clip showing you how to do a swizzle or walk around. Um, obviously, knowing how to do a swizzle already would be really helpful. Link to that in the description below. Uh, and having done a walk around, maybe a first move walk around, something easy, again, I'll put a link to one of those in the description below so that uh, in case those aren't in your repertoire, you can go back, fix that, and come back and be ready for one of these. This is a, it's a nice walk around. It's unusual in that you carry on doing the walk around, but you end up walking both forwards and backwards whilst doing the same walk around. Um, we'll show you it looks like this. It goes seven and eight. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, oh, one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Now, um, that's not my favorite exit. Uh, I might even show you an alternative exit later. And uh, you obviously you can get into your swizzle however you like. So there's loads of different types of swizzles, swizzle entries out there. So we're just gonna do the standard one today. So we go semicircle back two hands, we come in and prep, we send the lady around, into a swizzle. We're actually going to lead the lady to walk forwards and we're going to walk forwards as well. Now we could walk around. This bit could take however long you want it to take. But whilst you're doing your walk at some point, you use the left hand to lead your return and we switch to the alternative swizzle. We're still rotating around each other the same way, but now to keep the rotation going, we're walking backwards. And then at some point, after we've walked for a while, we use the right hand to lead a turn. We switch into the other side of the swizzle again. And now to continue the rotation in the same direction, we're both walking forwards again. And then the obvious exit is to just lead a double, traveling return, letting go with the right hand, and we're done. So that's the basic. Um, let's talk numbers. And we'll keep, we'll keep the walking to a minimum. So we go back, one, preparation, two, round into the swizzle, three. We're gonna walk for one and two. Then we're gonna go return, return. So now we're going backwards, we're gonna go one and two. Then we're gonna go turn, turn, and we're gonna go one and two, return, return, and back. So, let's try it. Let's see how we go. Five, six, seven, and eight. We go out back. Prepare, turn, walk, walk, return, return, walk, walk, turn, turn, walk, walk, return, return, and back. Okay, so we've done the whole thing. One small, tiny change is that when you're in the swizzle walking forwards this way, it's quite nice just to keep the lady walking, bring the left hand onto the right shoulder, release with the right shoulder slide your way out of it, and it gives you, I think, a nicer feel to the exit. So let's try again, and this time, we'll see if we can shoulder slide our way out. So here we go, five, six, a swizz of walk around. We go a back, prepare, turn, walk, walk, return, return, walk, walk, turn, turn, a walk, walk, shoulder slide, catch, return, and back. Hope you like it. Two for the price of one. Um, do like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Big thank you to everyone who likes and subscribes because it does help promote what we're doing. Uh, music recommendation on the end, something nice to practice what we've just done too. And as always, thank you for watching World of Floorcraft. I hope you've enjoyed learning some modern jive. There is a link to some music that is good to dance modern jive to. Thank you to everyone who hit subscribe. You are helping us to make more clips. Thank you. Keep dancing.